Well, even with the warmer temperatures, it was just cold enough to open the outdoor skating rinks in Bemidji today. The Parks and Recreation Department was busy preparing the two rinks for public use. Mel Meyer has more. Can you come to me? Around noon, Megan McDonald and almost two-year-old son Walker were out on the ice in Nymore. Whoa, whoa, is right. That's where all the big kids play hockey. While the Parks and Recreation yes, Department had yet to clear away the snow, it didn't deter the pair. Now that that nice cold week is gone and the ice is nice, we'll probably come back a couple times a week. Over in City Park, workers were busy clearing the ice. They need to remove the snow in order to then flood the rinks, which takes about an hour. We know the ice isn't in the best conditions. Uh, just bear with us. We'll do the best we can. A few hours later, the rinks were ready to go. Dan Corrales was there shortly after the warming house opened. But my two kids, uh, you know, first first word they hear that the ice is ready, they they're ready to get out here. With the rinks open, some were eager to test out a new skill. I just tried this program, and then we got all this stuff free. For others, getting out on the rink is second nature. Kaden Oshie is a cousin of TJ Oshie, who plays on the NHL Washington Capitals. He says maybe he'll follow in his footsteps, but for now, he's playing for the fun of it. And I heard that this is going to be opening today, so I just came out here because I wanted to skate because I haven't skated in a long time. The season opener couldn't have come soon enough. It feels just great to be out here and be with my friends and skate around. The warming houses will be closed on Christmas Day and will have limited hours on Christmas and New Year's Eve. In Bemidji, I'm Mel Meyer, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.